second is removed. All right. Let's understand how to uh, square three digit numbers. Now, I, I hope all of you already got how to find out the duplexes. Now let's see how to square the numbers. So basically, we let's take the most easiest one. So let's say square of 123. So what are you going to do here is you're going to first find the duplex of 1. Then you're going to find the duplex of 12. Then you're going to find the duplex of 123. As soon as you re reach the last digit of the entire number, you will start leaving the first digit. So that's the duplex of 23 will be the next then. And the last will be duplex of. Is this clear until here? The so duplex of one is one. Duplex of two is two ones are two double four. Duplex of 123 will be three ones are three, three double six. And six plus four, that's going to give you a 10. Two threes are duplex of 23 will give you two threes are six double 12. And the duplex of three is going to give you nine. Now you're not going to do anything, just write the numbers all together. So this will give you a one. This will give you a five. This will give you another one. This will give you a two and that will give you a nine. So this is practically the square of 123. All right. I'm going to do one more question here. Let's find out the duplex or oh, sorry, not the duplex now. Let's do the squares. So let's say um, the square of 243. Now, what are we going to do here if it's the square of 243? Now, I'm going to do write it into a straight column so that, you know, you get it. So, for you know, we'll start with the duplex of 2. Then, the next is going to be the duplex of 24. Then, you're going to have the duplex of 243. Then you're going to have the duplex. Now you have reached the last digit. So you finished all the digits. So now you start leaving the first digit. So that's going to be duplex of 43. And you're going to be, the last will be the duplex of three. Am I clear? Yes. Now let's start writing the values of all that you have here. Duplex of two will be four. Duplex of 24 will be four to the eight. 8660. Now remember, every place we can write only one digit. So for the remaining places, it's going to go carry forward. So if there's an extra digit before that, it's going to go as a carry forward. For example, we have 4 to the 8 and 8 double 16. So that's going to be 16. Duplex of 24 is 16. Duplex of 243. So 2 3 is a 6. 6 double 12. 12 plus 16, that is 28. Correct? Duplex of 43. That is 4 3 is a 12. 12 double 24. And duplex of 3, that gives you a 9. Now, the only thing that you have to do is write all of the numbers together, taking care of the carryovers as well while you add. So you're going to do 4 plus 1 will give you a 5. 6 plus 2 is 8. Now, if you look at these two digits, there's a carryover here. 6 plus 2 is 8. 8 plus 1 will give you a 9. That gives you a zero, and that is a four, and that is a nine. So this is two, four, three, six. <coughs> Have you guys got it? Yeah. Yes, Ovia, have, have, have you understood what we are doing? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Now let's find out, or let's take a larger number. And see, let's all of us do together. You do it and I'll also do it. Don't, uh, um, you know, I'll do it very slowly for you all so that you can match up the answers after some time. So let's find out 647 square.
Are you guys getting it? Yeah. So if you have seen the entire method actually can be done in such a short manner. We are going to do the next form using the shortest form. So you know how to do it. All right, can we do one more question? Yeah. All of you, both of you, have you got the answers? Yeah. Okay. yeah. Let's say, let us find out the square of, uh, say, 583. See now, just pay attention, okay? There is no need to write the entire column. So the duplex of 5, 25. Duplex of 58. 5 eggs of 40 double, 80. Duplex of full 583. So that's 5 threes are 15, 15 double 30, and 30 plus 64. That gives you 94. Correct? Now you finish the number, so you start 83. Excuse duplex me. of 83. I have to go now. Yes. Okay, one second. We'll just finish the last question. Okay. Uh, over here? Yeah. I'm just doing the last question, then Akhil can leave no problem. A3s are 24, 24 double 48, and 3-3s three are 9. So your answer, Akhil, is going to be 3, 3, 9, 8, 8, 9. If you've got the answer, just check your answer if you've got it. Okay, sure. Yeah. 